going on boys the first uh type of video where i kind of just laid back talked to you guys with some gameplay in the back did pretty well so i thought i'd do it again um so in today's video i'm going to talk about how i got kicked out of mr sub and some other shit happened this day too so i'm just gonna kind of walk you through this day because honestly it was it was kind of an awesome day but very like odd and weird it all happened throughout the school day so it was pretty interesting. So, you know, it started as a normal day. Fucking woke up late as fuck. I had school. I probably woke up around like 8. And I got to school like 8.30. And my school starts at 7.50. It was like half an hour, 40 minutes late. And, you know, how my school is, is when you walk into the, like, into the school, there's the cafeteria on the right side. So as soon as you walk into the school, there's the cafeteria. And I saw a whole bunch of kids in that cafeteria. So I thought, you know what? Oh, shit. Maybe my class is having an assembly, you know, where you go, you see whatever people are presenting and stuff. I thought maybe I was supposed to be there since I came in late. I don't know what was happening. So I decided to uh, to go into the cafeteria, find out what was happening. I saw a whole bunch of my friends. People were walking around, talking to each other. There were, there were awards being given out. So, you know, in my head, I was probably thinking like, in my, in my head, I was thinking like, you know, shit, this looks like a pretty cool assembly. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go find some of my friends, you know, I found them. And they kept asking me why I'm there. And I, I, I like I was, I was really confused of why they kept asking me why I was at this assembly. Uh, lo and behold, I look at the, uh, the whiteboard where, you know, where it's being presented. Turns out it was a honor roll assembly. And I, I'm nowhere near an honor roll student, right? I'll admit it. I ain't got good marks, but I saw honor roll assembly and I couldn't stop laughing because at this assembly they were giving away food. Bro, as soon as I went into the assembly, I started grabbing all kinds of food. Uh, so I'm I'm telling you guys right now, I ate like two croissants, a whole cinnamon bun, and a few other things, bro. I don't even know what I grabbed, but I grabbed it, dude. I had like two bagels too. Oh my, I had bagels, bro. I ate like a king, and it was for honor roll students. Me realizing then, I'm like, that's why these teachers were giving me weird looks, because they've had me before, and I got like 60s in their class. So they're wondering how the hell I managed to get honor roll. And it was pretty interesting, because my friends are all laughing, and, I, and then it clicked. So what I ended up doing was I hit my friend up, my like, yo, listen here, what, what do you want for food, bro? We got croissants, cinnamon buns, everything. You know, so I tried getting out of there before I got in trouble because obviously these teachers know I'm not at an 80% honor roll. Um, so then I ended up getting, I don't know what I got for him, for my, for my friend. Uh, I got, I, maybe I got him like a few croissants and a cinnamon bun, I think it was. Uh, you know, so that, that was, that, then the assembly was finished. So I went up there, it got my guy a whole bunch of food, bro. We ate like kings in our class. People are asking me where I got the food from, you know what I'm saying? I'm not telling them anything. I'm just saying that uh, there's an assembly downstairs and I was a part of it. That's all I said. And they tried going, but they weren't able to. Uh, this kind of leads, though, into the, the Mr. Sub part. So that's the very, very morning class. Then around, I think it was, I think, one-ish. Um, I think I'd run one or one. I don't know when school ends for us anymore because it's been quarantined. So we have different class times now, but... Maybe I think I think school ended around like 140 for us. So then around 140, you know, we start we went uh, we went to the plaza because we were gonna go get you know food. We were both hungry. Uh, my friend goes into the I think it was I think he went to the bakery, right? So he was gonna get some pasta, that kind of stuff. Uh, he went to the thing. We kind of ordered. Uh, and then I wanted Mr. Sub, right? And here's how the how the Mr. Sub story parts uh, start. How the Mr. Sub story starts. So. I go into Mr. Sub, you know, I'm ordering my food. My friends are being fucking stupid outside. Um, I don't know if I'll say, I, I don't know if I should say the names, whatever, but just know that these two guys are like my best friends and they'll like, they'll probably be in more stories if I do more of these, but I go into Mr. Sub and I'm starting to order food, right? And I see these dumbasses playing with a sign outside. Like, you know, the sign that's in like a metal holder and you can pull the sign out and in you know, you can change it. It says like what what the what the thing uh what the meal of the day is, and kind of food there is, what the prices are. That's what's in this. That's what's on this sign. 
And it's funny as shit because I just see these guys pulling it upward, downward, upward. You know, I didn't think anything of it. It's not, they weren't doing anything to break the sign, to, to do anything. It was a fucking paper sign, right? So you can't really break the sign or do anything to it. They were, I think I thought they were fine. But I'm ordering, and the Mr. Sub lady looks at me. She goes, hey, are those your friends? I was like, uh, yeah, <laughs> sadly. But I tell her, yeah, those are my friends. And she looks at me, and she tells me to tell them to either stop playing with that sign or she's calling security. In my head, I was like, what the fuck? I'm like, you're going to call security because these dumbasses are just touching your sign? I like, that's not even that bad, right? But whatever, it's her store. You know what? It's her store. I'll respect it. But as, as, as stupid as it is, like, they literally didn't do anything with that sign. They maybe played with it for fucking 20 seconds at most and she got she got so cheesed at them that she she told me tell them that security will come if they don't stop playing with it you know what i went outside i'm like yo she's trying to call security right knowing my friends they start touching the sign again they want to see if she'll call the security uh so i go back in i'm telling her what i want on the sub and lo and behold this guy's touching the sign again this time He's not really like doing it as much as before, but he's kind of just teasing her at this point. And she looks at me, she gets all pissed off. I thought she I thought she wasn't gonna make my sub and I'd have to go somewhere else to eat, but she got all pissed off. She gets on her phone, she calls security, she then walks outside of the sub place. I, I, I honest to God, bro, when she walked outside the sub, I was so fucking hungry at that point, I wanted to go behind the thing and make my own sub. But she goes outside, she goes to walk over to the security car because the guy won't answer her. You know, I, I wonder why, but she walks over to the security car. She starts talking to him and being like, hey, there's these two kids playing with my sign, blah, blah, blah. The security guy comes over and tells my, my friends, literally, she goes, yeah, so she's a little bit on the, uh, the annoying side. I don't know why she keeps calling security. Apparently, she's called security for like just the smallest things ever. And we don't go to the Mr. Sub anymore because she, she is like very very annoying uh she'll call security if you have wet shoes and you walk into her store like she is very very annoying that's what we've came to the conclusion of um but so the security comes tells them hey listen she's a little bit annoying but just don't play with her sign just get out of here uh my friends you know what they're like okay yeah sure whatever you walk, then the security walks in tells her that they won't play with the signs anymore and then she kicks me out of Subway, but I'm like, Miss, I just paid you $10 for my sub. Can you please make my sub? She got all annoyed. She ended up making my sub. Um, she didn't give me the free cookie of the day, because, you know, when you order the sub of the day, you get a free cookie. She didn't give me my fucking cookie, but it's okay. It's okay. I can live without a cookie, right? We started leaving, and it was like we were, we were in tears at that point. We were laughing so hard that we were literally just got security called on us. For playing with a Mr. Sub sign. If you guys don't know what Mr. Sub is, it's, it's basically just the equivalent of Subway, but just shittier. Because the, the Subway that we have is like another kilometer out from this Mr. Sub, so we didn't, we didn't want to walk that far, but... Yeah, I mean, like, that, that day was just funny as fuck, man. Like, we did nothing all day. We just screwed around at school. It was, it was a pretty good day. I think we even had supply teachers, too, so... It was a really good day, man, but... That's Subway, man. She she was so pissed off. I still think to this day, she hates us. Like, <laughs> when she sees us walking around the plaza, or thinking about going to Mr. Sub, I, I bet she hates us. Like, the subs are good, but fuck, I'm not I'm not going in there, bro. She was that annoying. Fuck that. I'm asking her for extra mayo. She's going to kill me. Like, I don't I don't fuck around with that Mr. Sub anymore. So, I mean, that was a story. I guess, it's, I guess it's more funny for me, because I actually lived it, and was there in the moment. But... I mean, try best to visualize the story. It was pretty funny. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's pretty much the story. Then I went home, streamed, or played video games, or did whatever. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed today's story time type thing. I want to make more of these, but I, I just don't know if I can say half the stories that I have. I'll wait till I keep. I'll, I'll wait till I'm 19, so they become uh, legal. But uh, yeah, I mean, that's it for today's video. So. If you guys want to see more story time videos, I have a lot of stories because I, I, we do screw around a lot. So if you guys want to see another one, you know, smack that like button, comment down below. Peace the fuck out, boys.
or whatever game. If you guys want to see like a different game in the background, tell me too. Because I, I enjoy making these videos and showing my stories. So if you guys like the video, like I said, like the video, comment down below, and I'm out. Peace.